Hi everybody, I'm Melissa from cloudmom.com. This is my baby, Bracy. He's six months old, although he's a little bit small for a six month old since he was a preemie. A lot of us are very anxious at this stage to see our baby sit up. So I wanted to walk through with you guys some exercises that are really, really great in order to encourage your baby to sit up. And the first of these is just to get in the habit of holding your baby on your lap or on your leg when you're burping them or otherwise, and just loosening your hold, giving them some leeway, allowing them to start working their back muscles a little bit better, still supporting them, but providing more of a framework in which they can move rather than just holding them so steadily. So that's the number one thing. Here's the second thing that I do that I find to be really, really helpful. I sit often when I'm finished feeding Bracy. Let me move my microphone a bit here. And I put Bracy right between my legs like this. That way he can start to sit up on his own. And I know that he's secure as between my legs. And that if he falls, he's just going to fall back, you know, onto my torso like this. And he's in a very safe and secure position. So that's the second thing you can do. The third thing you can do is to carry your baby around a lot like this on your side. What I like to do is to hold Bracy's leg with my hand and that way I know he's really, really secure. He's getting stronger now so he doesn't need me quite as much and I try to make sure that he's secure. I make sure that he's not going to fall back but I give him a little bit more liberty and freedom to start to move around and use his back muscles. And here's one of the best things when it comes to helping your baby develop the strength to sit up and eventually to crawl and to walk. Baby sit-ups. When I first saw these sit-ups, it struck me that they looked too dangerous because I worried that my baby's head would fall back and I didn't think it was something that you could do with your baby. But my pediatrician has told me, in fact, yes, that they're a really great exercise. You wanna do them really slowly. So you position your baby like this you hold on to their hands. Hi, Bracy. Let me take your hands. Right now, he's very interested in the bedspread. And you slowly move them up like this. And you slowly bring them back down, making sure that their head doesn't fall back. This is great for abdominal strength and great for back strength and for necks. Hi, there you go. So that's the baby sit up. Another thing you can do to get your baby into the habit of sitting on their own is to start to spread their legs out a little bit like this and to position something in front of them that interests them like this toy and to see if they will reach their hands forward. Bracy's not ready for this yet. And of course, an exercise that is really, really important for babies at this stage is tummy time. You wanna be doing this several times a day. It builds a lot of strength in the neck, in the back, in the legs. And this is how babies will begin to learn how to crawl. You have to be really careful with tummy time because babies start to get very strong very quick and they can roll off the side of the bed. So you want to be really, really careful with it. Here you can see Bracy. he's gotten enough strength and he's working on flipping over onto his back. Come on, Bracy. let's see if you can do it. Come on, Bracy. he did it. He flipped onto his back and that's something that you'll be really happy to see your baby develop the strength to do. So anyway, those are some exercises that will help your baby sit up. Please remember that there's a wide range of normal when it comes to what babies do when. I always tell people with my older five kids that they sat up late, they walked late, they talked late, and now they're all doing just great. So hang in there. Thank you so much for watching cloudmom.com and please check in again for more how-to videos.